aquas my aqua gang how are you guys doing how are we doing today um as you can see i have a new setup going on you know simple i love butterflies and that's actually my logo so why not right we got a little halloween going on just a little bit um and you know this is you and the lunatic till death do you guys part aquarius obviously i'm just joking but you know i think it's funny i think it's funny guys this is you guys right here um welcome you guys know this is going to be yet another general reading to see what kind of lunatic may try to come towards us okay keep in mind the situation here could be vice versa or interchangeable um this could be you know completely reversed if you're watching this for an aquarius okay aquarius please do not forget to like this video for me please um give it a big thumbs up if for some strange reason you feel like it does not resonate for you please check your moon the rising and your Venus signs um also aquarius please do not forget to subscribe to my new channel it is called pretty intuitive to roll two um, you can just type it in and search by channel or you can go to my community post and you will see where I mentioned my new channel. I will be coming out with a new video this week, All right? So guys, let me know what you guys think about the setup. Um, I like it. I feel much more comfortable. I have much more space. So see what's going on. <laughs> All right. I'm just a little bit under the weather, but that's not going to stop nothing. <laughs> Aquarius. What is coming towards Aquarius in love? What do we have for Aquarius? Aquarius. Aquarius in love. What is coming towards Aquarius? Sun, moon, rising, and Venus in love. What do we have for Aquarius? Thank you. Aquarius, we have explore. Spend some more time dating before you make a long-term commitment. Maybe that's what you guys are doing. Some of you may have came out of something very crazy recently um, or your person and somebody just wants to just take their time, go with the flow, right? Um, oh, there's a whole lot of flirtation going on, Aquarius. Someone is flirting with you now, so take notice and flirt back if you like them. So they want you to flirt with them, Aquarius. <laughs> they want you to flirt with them. All right. Very interesting. So someone definitely likes what they see. This could be someone flirting with you at work <laughs> or online, liking your pictures a lot or giving you, you know, your profile a lot of attention. All right, Aquarius. What is coming towards Aquarius in love, spirits? Aquarius. What do you have for Aquarius in love? What is coming towards Aquarius in love? Aquarius, you have decision. It's time to decide about this relationship. Um, somebody obviously may want more here, okay? And there's there's a need to decide what the hell are we doing, okay? You have go slow, take time to get to know each other. I just mentioned going slow, right? All right, we're going to be using the messages towards the end and also some charms. I know you guys really like those charms. <laughs> Aquarius, you could be connected to a Capricorn. What is coming from Aquarius? Or a Pisces. What is coming towards Aquarius? In the Aquarius. You can be connected to a fire sign, Aries, a Leo, Sagittarius. Alright, what is the overall energy in love for Aquarius spirit? What is the overall energy? Overall energy, Aquarius, is the star. Okay, in the reverse. So some of you, you you know, you have your eye on someone or someone has their eye on you. They want to get closer to you. Someone sees you as the star Aquarius. And they just want to, you know, they, they just want to get a little Aquarius loving, you know. They just want to get a little close to you. Um, some of you, you may be dealing with someone who's not feeling very optimistic about this connection right now. Uh, because they want to get close. I just keep hearing someone wants to get close. All right. Let's see, Aquarius. What is coming towards Aquarius in love? What do we have, Spirit? Aquarius in love. What is coming? What is coming towards Aquarius in love? Aquarius. 
nine of pentacles so you're dealing with somebody aquarius who is a very independent this could be you as well obviously we are independent you may be dealing with someone who's kind of the same aquarius someone who's on the same wavelength as you very fun person this is someone who they enjoy their freedom, Aquarius. Someone really enjoys their freedom. You may be enjoy, enjoying your freedom right now, Aquarius. So you may not be keen to, you know, settle down or get in another relationship right now. Especially for those of you who just came out of toxic relationships or marriage with the lunatic, okay? What is coming towards Aquarius and love? So I feel like Aquarius, you definitely need someone who can keep up with you, okay? You need somebody who is just as independent and a free spirit as you are you don't need anyone who's gonna try to you know restrict your freedom what's coming towards aquarius in love angels what is coming what it seems like aquarius whatever this person is you're definitely going to be you know really seeing this person um as the end all be all even though you may not be ready to admit that <laughs> what's coming towards aquarius and love spirit we have three more cards what is coming towards Aquarius and love angels? One more card. Yeah, some of you are definitely playing the field a little bit, Aquarius. You're opening yourself up a little bit more, okay? Meaning that, like I said, you your focus on yourself, self-care, your business, something about your home. You may be moving homes or, you know, just uh, renovating your home or just kind of really making your space very uh, comfortable. You're living comfortable, Aquarius. You're doing well for yourself. Um, you're stable, right? But there's one person in particular, <laughs> Aquarius, who definitely looks like they could be, um, you know, the one. <laughs> I mean, this person is fun. They're not going to try to restrict your freedom. They see things the way you see things, Aquarius, and that is very good, right? That's a match made in heaven. Um, that's what I just keep hearing for your reading match made in heaven. Okay. I feel like Aquarius, you're letting your guard down just a little bit. Um, you know, to allow these connections to take place, right? You're letting it down a little bit. You're no longer like this, completely protecting yourself. You're being a little bit easygoing. Um, like I said, some of you, you just came out of something that you're healing from, um, something crazy. So you probably just uh if you're gonna settle down it has to be the one it really has to be someone who gets you excited about life somebody who just shares your vision and i feel like this is the perfect match for you aquarius but there's a need to go slow okay um you have the six of wands this is gonna be your ideal partner aquarius you know i don't just say shit just to say it but this person has their eye on you they you know out of a crowd of people they feel like you are, you know, you got it going on. <laughs> they feel like you got it going on, Aquarius. They really like what they see, okay? Um, and they they, they want to win you over. They do want to win you over, okay? Bottom of the deck, you have the Eight of Wands. You may have met this person online, Aquarius. But, they're, you know, Cupid's arrow is striking. This person has it really bad for you. They're very excited to talk to you they like you a lot um you may be dealing with someone who travels a lot for work or someone who just likes to travel this is someone who doesn't really like to stay stagnant okay they like to um have fun that's what they are aquarius um they have a love for traveling um maybe you guys both have a love for traveling but you can expect, Aquarius, that you're going to have a lot of conversations um, in the upcoming weeks with a lot of different people. There's a lot of people who are very interested in you, but one person in particular is going to really catch your attention. Because not only do you guys share the same vision, you guys have the same hobbies, right? They're stable. They're stable. They, they love themselves. They are a stable individual, which is what you need. You don't need anyone codependent or crazy. So, Aquarius, you're letting your guard down. Like I said, nine of wands reverse. Um, I feel like this person in particular is going to rock your world, Aquarius. I hate to say it. <laughs> but this motherfucker is going to rock your world. Um, especially when you guys, you know, do the do, Aquarius. I feel like it's going to really be shocking you. You may not, some of you may not have expected to find love or to 
fall for this person, but it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen, Aquarius. Um, the temperance in reverse, just be careful, Aquarius, you know, less is more sometimes, you know, you don't need to overdo it, okay? You guys may drink a little bit and get it on or something, drunk sex, I don't know, Aquarius, but bottom line, I feel like you could be connected to a Sagittarius. There's a whole new chapter starting for you, Aquarius. You got someone new, um, a new experience coming towards you. This is someone who may, you know, something about travel, they've traveled the world, I don't know, but this is, you're going to feel complete. This is everything that you need, Aquarius. This person is literally everything that you've ever wanted. Okay, Aquarius. So let's do a little clarification. Just a little bit because the message is very clear here. Um, what is this Ten of Cups about for Aquarius? What is this Ten of Cups about for Aquarius? Oh, the star came out, guys. So, you got your eye on this person. This is the one. You're going to feel like this is the one. Um, they feel like you're the one, Aquarius. So, I don't know why I'm hearing next door neighbor. Some of you, this person could live in your same neighborhood. Or you may find love very close to you in close proximity. What is the Ten of Cups? You may be connected to another Aquarius. But the signs that I'm seeing here, Aquarius. Ooh, and they're going to treat you so well, Aquarius. Um, the signs that I'm seeing here is Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and another Aquarius, okay? What is the Four of Coins reverse for Aquarius? Four of Coins reverse. Exactly. You're opening yourself up. Four of Coins reverse again. Four of Swords reverse for Aquarius. Yeah, some of you have baggage. You're healing from a long-term relationship. Um... But I feel like this is someone that you do, you do feel committed to. Like you, you feel like this person, you're serious about them and you can tell that they're serious about you. But you guys may just be moving a little slow. Sometimes this is good. This energy is good, Aquarius, because rushing sometimes can just kind of end up in flames, right? What is the six of wands for Aquarius? But I'm telling you, this is the one, Aquarius. And there's no denying that. There's no denying that. Big opportunity with this person. Big opportunity. You may meet them online. What is this four of wands? Some of these could be your twin flame as well. You guys are very similar. Um, that tends to be a twin flame connection. You're going to meet a twin flame. Ten of cups again. Oh, my God. I'm so happy for you guys, Aquarius. I'm so happy. So that's what's coming up in the cards, Aquarius, okay, um, for what's going on here. There's a perfect match coming towards you, which is very nice. All right, let's see. What does this person want to say to Aquarius? Keep in mind, this could be um, messages coming from anyone. You will know who it's coming from, okay? So Aquarius, they let me pull the cards and I will. What does this person want to say to Aquarius? Some of you, this could be someone that you already know, right? Um, and, okay, they, they're they ready. They feel like they're in a stable place. They're ready to, to get it on, <laughs> okay? Maybe finances were the reason in the past, or maybe they really needed to kind of find themselves a little bit, Aquarius. Too prideful to say sorry. They say, I have too much pride once again. Maybe someone who does have a lot of pride. Is there someone else? They're worried that there's somebody else. <laughs> Call or text me. They want you to reach out. I picture you when I'm with them. So anybody that they're with, Aquarius, if you already know this person, they always imagine you, okay? And I think we're soulmates. So they think that you guys are soulmates, Aquarius. All right. So let's see what's going on here. Who is Aquarius dealing with? <clears throat> Who is Aquarius dealing with, please? So, Aquarius, there's a lot of angel wings here. Something about the ocean and swimming. And, yeah, um, this person may definitely like to. They may live overseas or they, they may like to travel a lot. You have a J, an N, a G, a J again, an L, an H. So, they could have these letters in their name. There's a tree of life here. 
you have two swans kissing. Ooh, soulmates. Whenever this this one comes out, it's usually like a soulmate indicator. Uh, someone may have a dog. There's an F here, a B, a G, J. Some of you may have lost someone recently. It says always with me. This person's always with you. And you have the key to this person's heart, Aquarius. That's what's showing. Okay. There's a Q. So that's what we got, Aquarius. Let me know what the freak is going on. I love you guys so much. See you guys next time.